going to show you how to drill and fix to a plasterboard wall. First and foremost, make sure it's a plasterboard wall. By tapping on it, getting a hollow sound, we know it's plasterboard. And now, here's what we'll need to do the job. Power drill and steel or wood drill bit. Suitable plasterboard fixings. Multi-purpose detector. Hammer. A pencil. The first thing we do is decide on where in the wall we want to hang this picture. We mark a spot at the height that we want it, in the centre. And now we know the position of the hole we are going to drill. Now that we've marked the wall, we're just going to check by using a multi-purpose detector that there's no hidden hazards behind the wall. Once you're satisfied there's no pipes or cables behind the walls, we're ready to drill. Now plasterboard is quite soft and there's a lot of plasterboard fixings. Here's a few plasterboard fixings and how they work. Here's a selection of fixings and I'm going to tell you a little bit more about them. This is a nylon drywall fixing. It's suitable for lightweight round the house fixings. The way to use this fixing is to use the drill bit size indicated on the packet and drill the wall. Place your plug into the hole. Then put a screw in and as the screw tightens, it compacts the plug, which in turn stops the plug from sliding out of the wall. This is an ideal fixing for any lightweight things that you may have to fix to the wall around your house, such as a picture or a toilet roll holder. Here we have another plasterboard fixing. This plasterboard fixing is specifically for plasterboard. Again, use the drill bit size indicated on the packet to drill the hole. You slide your wall plug into it, and as you tighten the screw, the arrowhead expands and clamps to the back of the sheet. This is an ideal fixing for any light to medium weight objects you may want to fit to any stud walls throughout the house. This is an intercept fixing, and it comes usually with a clamping gun. Can be used on its own, but the clamping gun makes it very easy for plasterboard walls. Use the drill bit size as indicated on the packet to drill your hole. Place your anchor into the hole. The clamp quickly locks the fixing in place, then tighten the screw. This fixing will create a good firm anchor to any plasterboard wall. Here we have a spring anchor fixing. In order to use this fixing, use the drill bit sides indicated on the packet, then drill the hole. The fixing slides through the hole, and when it gets through to the other side, it springs. And as we tighten the screw, this plate tightens to the back of the sheet. This fixing is suitable to all plasterboard walls and provides a great anchor to any heavy object. Here we have another screw-in plasterboard fixing. This fixing comes with its own screw. Very simple to use. You remove the screw. On top of the fixing you see a screw head. You place it to the plasterboard and you screw in. You can do it with either a hand screwdriver or a cordless screwdriver. The worm on this worms its way around and creates a good hold for pictures or lightweight objects throughout the house. In this case the picture is light, so I'm going to use a 7mm plasterboard fixing along with a 7mm steel drill bit. Now, this drill bit has to be the same size as the fixing, as you don't want the fixing to be loose in the wall. And before we start drilling, always think safety. Put on your safety glasses. Now we're going to put our 7mm drill bit into our chuck. This is a quick release chuck, so all we have to do is place the bit in, put the drill in forward, and pull the trigger. And once your bit is in place, we're going to drill our hole. Remember, not to use hammer action on your drill, as you don't want to tear the paper backing on the plasterboard inside the wall. And now to fit our wall plug. You can use your hammer just to tap it in. And next we're going to put in a 40mm screw into the wall and leave it hanging out of the wall, maybe half an inch, 10, 12mm. We'll go ahead and we'll screw this into the wall. There you go, screw in place and we're ready to hang the picture. There you go, I've shown you how to drill and fix to a plasterboard wall. For more helpful hints and tips, go to woodiesdiy.com. <laughs>